Hi, everyone. Welcome back to our channel. This is Frank from YOLO Live. SRT and RTMP inputs are one of the advantages of YOLO Box Ultra. We have previously detailed the specific operation process of SRT input, and today we will introduce the usage of RTMP input. Generally speaking, RTMP input can be used for the connection of drone shooting lenses or electronic cameras. To help everyone understand these two features more coherently and smoothly, we will continue to use OBS to explain the RTMP input function of YOLOBOX. And before officially starting, please ensure that all devices and softwares are connected to the same network. When we need to utilize the RTMP input feature of YOLOBOX, YOLOBOX takes on the role of an RTMP client. In other words, this also implies that the device we are expecting to send the RTMP video stream should possess the capability to do so, or to put it another way, it should be able to function as an RTMP server. How to understand the difference and relationship between RTMP client and RTMP server? If the transmission process of the RTMP source is imagined as a postal process, the RTMP source is the parcel being mailed. Then the RTMP client is the receiver of the package, and the RTMP server is the post office. Most drones and digital cameras offer RTMP server functionality, such as DJI drones, which supports RTMP server. However, it's important to note that OBS acts as an RTMP client, not an RTMP server. Therefore, for the sake of demonstration, we've set up an additional RTMP server. Considering that the process of setting up an RTMP server is quite complex and requires some level of expertise, we didn't include the server setup process in this video. Should you wish to learn more about this, you can search for relevant tutorial videos on YouTube or leave a comment in the comments section. Next, we are going to implement sending the video source on OBS to my YOLOBOX Ultra as an RTMP source. Now we come to the main interface of OBS. Click on Settings in the lower right corner. Enter the Stream option. Select Custom from the menu bar at the top. Here we also need to provide the server URL and stream key. After the RTMP server is turned on, I need to generate an RTMP URL on the RTMP server. It's RTMP NOSH 192.168.20.244.1935 NOSH live, live stream. So what do these characters mean? Well, to better understand the URL, it can be divided into three parts. The beginning, RTMP, Archie, is fixed. Here, the second part is made up of the IP address and port. The IP address is the IP address of the network that the RTMP server is connected to. I can find this information in the network settings on my computer. The third part is the stream key, which is live live stream. Please note that the format of the RTMP URL is not completely fixed, and there are slight differences in the RTMP URLs provided by different RTMP servers. For example, the RTMP URL generated by GoPro does not include port information, and the RTMP input URL entered on YOLOBOX is based on the RTMP URL provided by the RTMP server. After setting up this information on the RTMP server, copy and paste this information into OBS. It's worth noting that in OBS, you need to break down the RTMP URL for input. That is, in the server, you only need to enter the IP address and port, which is RTMP uh, 192.168.20.244.1935. The latter part, live live stream, is filled in the stream key information box. Then return to the main page of OBS and click on Start Streaming. Now the operations for the OBS and RTMP server sections have been completed. Now open my Ultra's live operation panel, click Add Video Source in the lower left corner, drop down the Video Source menu, and select RTMP. Here we need to enter the RTMP input URL. The components of this RTMP input URL are the URL and stream key we set before. The only change is that we need to write these two pieces of information together. After all the information is entered, click Done in the upper right corner. Next, we can see the RTMP source in the lower left corner.
there could be several reasons contributing to the unsuccessful transmission of an RTMP source from OBS to YOLO Box Ultra. For starters, the issue could lie in the RTMP URL. This URL, in conjunction with the stream key, is a fundamental aspect of successful streaming. Should there be an error in typing, or if the URL is not the correct one, OBS will not be able to establish a connection with the YOLO Box Ultra. In addition, network complications could also be a potential obstacle. For example, if the internet connection you're using is slow or unstable, this could very well impede the sending of the RTMP source from OBS to the YOLO Box Ultra. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more insightful content. Also, don't forget to join our Facebook user group where lots of our customers share their user cases. Last but certainly not least, if you have any questions or would like to know more about YOLO Live, you can contact us via email at contactbyololive.com. If your need is urgent, you can call us at plus 86 137 If you need to express your needs through pictures or videos, you can also contact us via WhatsApp. The number is still plus 86 137 Thank you for watching this video. This is Frank. See you in the next video.